having lunch today at Woody's Roundup Rodeo Barbecue right behind me. We just checked in and uh, we're waiting to get the text to let us know that our table is ready. This is our first time, so we're really excited. How are y'all today? Good, how are you doing? Good, all right. Um, keep your ears open for Sarge when we head inside. He's okay. gonna let us know if Andy's coming. If Andy does come, we want to freeze, okay? Okay, got it. Whoa. Oh, this is cool. Wow. Okay, remember, she said if Andy comes, we have to freeze, so we gotta keep our ears out. Whoa, check this out, guys. This is amazing. Wow, I love it. Oh, it smells great in here. Oh, perfect, thank you very much. Okay, we just got seated, and here is the Roundup Rodeo menu. Get a wiggle on your greens. They have all kinds of salads. Uh, enjoy a platter of all the following house smoked items. Oh, so it looks like it comes out like, uh, I think I'm thinking like family style, like Ed, does everything come out? I think so. We're going to find out guys, this is our first time. So we're going to find out how this all works, but look at all these awesome items to choose from. Scott's going to hold our fort down here and uh, we just put in our order. I'm going to do a quick walk around and show you guys <laughs> how awesome this place is. So anytime we hear there's going to be like a, a bell and then we hear Andy might be coming, everybody has to freeze. The servers, all of us, everybody, or else we'll be in big trouble. So that is, uh, it was touch and go there the last time. Look at how cool this place is. Look at the ceiling. Wow. Oh my gosh. There is a lot of seating. It's huge in here, which is great. Oops, I'm going the wrong way. Let me turn around. <laughs> Let me go through there. There is that. Looks like this is actually really large. So they have a ton of seating, which is great because this is a very popular place. And uh, there is going to be a lot of competitiveness for getting tables here. But it looks like they knew that that was going to happen. And they created a lot of space here. There's booths for larger parties. There's a tables they can push together. Oh, that one's cool. Look at that. They, um, it's like a, they're sitting in the mine. Very nice with Stinky Pete. has arrived so they bring you all of the salads you don't have to pick from any of the salads it's all so this one is a watermelon salad and it has uh, well it's like watermelon slices no I don't think it's salad and it has uh, it has mint in it which makes it refreshing this looks like uh, apple slices and um, some greenery there and these are some buns or is it cheese like cheese rolls? Might be like the cheddar bay I think they're cheddar bay biscuits because you can dip it in something yeah and what's yours or yours is, oh, I, I saw that it was a tomato, tomato and cucumber, cucumber and salad. Onion. And onions, oh yeah, tomato, cucumber, All three and onion. my favorite thing. Yeah, Scott is not really into that, but I am, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna chow down on that one. Do the dino and give a big roar for the one you've all been waiting for, the one, the only, mind blow in here it is I mean as usual Disney takes care of every single detail I mean the details in here are just outstanding even if you look over here at the uh, busing station where they have all the silverware and trays and stuff that is all themed and when you look up to the ceiling every single inch of the from ceiling to wall to floor everything is covered and themed every little thing even the floor that we're walking on is like some type of board game i believe and uh then you have in the far distance here we have the milk carton 
that's one of the entrances for the cast members to get into the kitchen, come and go from the kitchen. And that is just amazing. I mean, it just everything is covered, so it doesn't look like, you know, little swinging doors, you know, just normal doors that go into a kitchen. And the second area to go into the kitchen is that uh, train station right there. That is another area where I've seen the cast members go in and out of. So just every little tiny thing here, every detail is amazing, absolutely amazing. Magnificent barbecue lunch has arrived. Scott, can you walk me through this? What do we got here? Well, here's our meat platter. All right. What we got ribs. We got chicken. Ribs, chicken. Uh, is that tri-tip? I believe tri-tip. Looks and like tri-tip. Is that sausage or that, some kind of? Yeah, it's not a honey bun. Yeah, <laughs> it's not a cinnamon roll, although it looks like it. Um, and then for the sides, look at that, you guys. Tater tots. That's a load of potatoes. Oh, a load of potatoes. And then oh, here wait, we have, no, no, no. I'm sorry. That is not. That's the tater tots. This is a load of potatoes. Yes, it is. That's this a is a potato salad. Oh. oh, wait. No, 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 no. Okay, we're confused. Maybe no, no, right. no. It's true. Okay, true. okay, guys. Right. We're trying to get our... We're trying to figure this out. This is potato salad. That's the loaded potatoes. That's cucumbers. That, <laughs> that's the corn on the cob. And look at the yummy mac and cheese. How, what have you tried so far, Scott? I've had the rib. Is it good? A little bit dry. Oh, it's a little dry? But they're tasty. Okay. But they're dry. I've had the uh, brisket. Is it brisket? Or is it tricep? Whatever tricep, it is. Whatever it is. Yeah, we'll, we'll find out. <laughs> it's delicious. All right. Have you had the mac and cheese? Because that looks yummy. Yes, but it's dry as well. Oh, man. I was hoping I, for creamy like mac. Oh. I haven't had the corn yet. All right. Okay, we are going to dig into this magnificentness. Bon appetit, Scott. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Andy's approaching the rodeo. Everyone freeze. Freeze. Try to eat like the majority of what we're given, but um, there's no way. We need like four more people at least to help us eat the amount of food that they brought us. Honestly, it's a large amount for two people because they bring it the same amount for everyone to start with. Um, and it's just it was it's a lot. There's no way Scott and I could, we didn't even make a dent in it with the, the salads that we had before, which were outstanding. The fruit, the corn on the cob. We had four sides and uh, all the meat and everything. The rolls were great. The rolls were like um, cheddar biscuits, kind of like if you've been to Red Lobster, it's like that kind of cheddar biscuit, but it had like a sweet and sour dip that you could put it in if you want. Um, and I loved it, so does Scott, and he's picky. Uh, but honestly, the food, and it was all outstanding. I mean, very, very, very tasty, but it's a lot. So I just want you guys to be aware of that when you come here, that it is a lot to come, like super duper, like skip breakfast, or if you're coming for dinner, skip breakfast and lunch. It's a lot of food, but it's great food, great atmosphere, great theming. It's fun when, you know, Woody, you hear the bell and Woody is about to come into the room and everyone has to freeze because everybody does. The staff, the, all the cast members, all the guests, everybody, and everyone plays along. It's just fantastic. Love it, absolutely. Uh, so now we are waiting for our dessert. And uh, I'm not even sure how we're gonna even eat the dessert, but we're gonna give it a good old college try. Our dessert has arrived. So on the left, we have a silky chocolate mousse type of uh, dessert. And on the right, it's Forky's Cupcake. Looks like a chocolate cupcake with uh, white frosting. 
and you get a little Forky's cookie in there to go along with it. That might be marshmallow. Oh, maybe it's mar yeah, maybe it's marshmallow. It does look maybe more marshmallowy than frosting. Either way, looking good. Oh, something's happening. Hold on, guys. Let's see. And now, folks, it's my pleasure to introduce the Rockets. Topics, Ryder in the West. Do the dino and give a big round for what you've all been waiting for. The one, the only, Harry Cyrus Sanders. There we go. finally finished our meal here at Woody's Roundup Barbecue and it was outstanding everything. I highly recommend everyone to make a reservation. There are lots of tables but it's very popular and I can understand why it's awesome in here. So uh, definitely make reservations prior to your trip right at your uh, window for dining reservations, Disney dining re reservations before you come over to your vacation. And uh, just to let you know, if by any chance you do not get an opening during your um, dining, uh, Disney dining window, um, don't worry because when I was here checking in, the, uh, there was a people that didn't have any reservations and they did tell them that they had some openings because some people just didn't show up and some people canceled at the last minute. Because you are allowed to cancel any Disney dining two hours prior to your reservation and not get a penalty. So if people are, we actually ended up canceling a VR guest a few days ago because we had a change of plans. So people do cancel up to two hours before and you can just show up and there'll be some no-shows for various reasons. So don't give up, just show up. Thanks for joining us on our uh, adventure here at Woody's Roundup Barbecue. Don't forget to subscribe and have a magical day.